Jackie Ina gave us a palette and I'm Hey guys, it's Victoria Alexander here. If you are new, what it do, baby? Yeah. If you are a returning subscriber, hey cuz, how's it going? So, in today's video, I will be showing you guys how this look here was created using the Jackie Ina and Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. Okay. Jackie, 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 Jackie. That was probably terrible. However, it had to be done because it's Jackie Ina. Okay. But yeah, in today's video, like I said, I'll be showing you guys how I created this look here using the Jackie Ina and Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. So if you are interested, keep on watching. All right, so of course I've already did one eye off camera because me just trying to do my first eye on camera is just not the life for me. I'm just not that girl, okay? I did use a new eyeshadow primer today. I normally just use the Makeup Revolution Concealer in the shade C1. But today I actually used the Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadow primer and y'all it's bomb. I really, really, really like this eyeshadow primer so you haven't tried it i suggest you go out and try it so enough about that <laughs> you know today we're going to be using the jackie Anna palette look at this look at this look at this y'all this packaging is everything and i've already used it of course but um these are the shades i'm not a swatch girl um so i'm not gonna be swatching them but these are the shades they are really really pretty but these over here are what spoke to me today so i'm gonna be using credit ginger edges and sponsored y'all look at that first shade i'm dipping into is credit and i'm not gonna lie to y'all i had already tried to film this um i tried to do a uh halo eye and alpha it's alpha me and halo eyes we are not friends like I think I got two Halo Eye tutorials on my channel and the rest are cut creases, semi cut creases, smokies. <laughs> Me and Halo Eyes, we ain't eh uh -uh. we not meant to be. So yeah. Credit, I really love this shade. Um when I first dipped into it, when I originally tried to do this, I was like Oh, oh, brother, oh, 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 now nah. you got too much dip on your chip. This brown out there says, Jackie, you did that with credit. I wish my credit was as good as his eyeshadow. Ah, come on, tell him. You know. Next shot I'm gonna go into is edges. Shade as well. Next shade I'm going to dip into is Ginger. Oh, yeah, I'm just going back in the credit. For my lid color, I'm going to be taking Sponsored. Oh my God! Wow! Y'all. So pretty. As soon as I saw Jackie Ina uh, swatch it on her video, I was like, oh yeah, I gotta use that. <laughs> yes, sis. She or me, I have got to use that. It is so freaking pretty. And the fact that I didn't have to like, I just put it over the shadow that I already had down. I didn't have to wet the brush. I didn't have to put any more base down. Like, y'all, I'm gonna take this Morphe 321 and just go back in the credit and kind of just blend it into the outer corner here. There's more looks to come. I don't know if I'm gonna film every one of them, but trust me. I just love the fact that she 
you know, takes in consideration of people of darker skin tones. I love that. A lot of people find Jackie Anna annoying and just say this, that, and the third about her. I love Jackie Anna and I love what she stands for and that she's always trying to be inclusive and always wanting brands to be inclusive. I don't see why that's an issue, but you know, that's none of my business. But we love Jackie Anna over here, okay? That's all I can say. You know, we're gonna leave it at that. Let that sizzle in your spirit. I'm just going back into the eyeshadow primer and I'm taking this little brush here. It's going to be a base for my liner because I'm just going to use credit as a brown liner today. I'm going to go into credit with this brow brush by Real Techniques. So um, that is pretty much it for the eyes. I'm gonna do the rest of my face off camera and I'll be back in just a minute. All right guys, so this is the finished look and I am absolutely in love with this look. It is so freaking pretty. Like Jackie Ina gave us a palette and I'm here for it. Like, period. Period! <laughs> I'm definitely here for this palette. I feel like everybody needs to go out and get their hands on this palette. It's very, very pretty. I don't feel like pictures online do this palette justice. I'm just gonna be honest, like it's much prettier in person. The shades blend well together. Like I had no complaints while I was trying to blend these shades out. Yeah, the palette is amazing. Go out and get you one. If you haven't already, let me know how you feel down below in the comments. Um, but as for me and my house, <laughs> let me stop. But as for me, I absolutely love the palette. I think it's beautiful and yeah. So before I let you guys go, um, I do know that y'all will probably ask me what type of hair this is. Is it a wig? Is it bundles? What is it? This is the Bobbi Boss Lace Front Swiss Lace Wig. It is a premium synthetic wig in the style Xenon. Uh, this is the stock card. And I got her off of, I believe it's so good, bb.com. I'll link it down below. But they were having a summer sale and I got her for $11.90, okay? I think in total I paid with shipping uh, 15 bucks. I'm like here for this wig. It is so freaking pretty. It looks so natural to you, to me. It was like blunt cut. So I did kind of bump the ends just a little bit, but I'm definitely here for this wig. I will link it down below, plus other sites that sell it so that you guys can get your hands on it if you like. And of course, if you made it this far, then you already know <laughs> that we are family. Hey, auntie. So cousin, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Also hit that bell so you can turn on your post notifications and be notified every single time I upload. I love you guys, congratulations Jackie, and I will see you in my next video.